now time for some DTF. So I'm doing DTF on my same DTG printer. For some of you, it might be surprising because I've been told that uh, a lot of people say that you need specific DTF machine to do DTF. It's not the case. If you have a good DTG machine, you can do DTF on that. So, as you can see, reverse order is color first, white in the second. This has mostly white. Just this portion over here has some slight yellow. So, we're gonna print it. So, but uh, what this machine Epson uh, does is that along with the color wherever there is pure white, it just prints highlight white to give that extra brightness. So, we have attached a sheet. As you can see the sheet the design I'm waiting for it to come to the printer it has now and you don't need to stop the command in between change profiles it is gonna print in one more just like you print DDG t-shirts so the benefit of having a DDG machine which can do both is that TTF is I know it is getting a lot of hype and a lot of you know, craze right now among the printing fraternity but I still find DTG to be a bit more you know in terms of feel better than DTF you see it's a highlight white it's not pure white it's highlight white and the color of that coffee word coffee is already printed so now white is gonna print <laughs> this setting itself comes with the software free of cost no extra charges it's a good thing very good thing. the biggest advantage that i find of dtf is that it is you know very inexpensive it takes roughly maybe 40 percent of the cost of the dtg so that is where you know people shift towards that but as i said if you have a good dtg machine you can do both can see it. here I have an example of another DTF which I did with this machine powder melted and wonderful colors you know, popping colors So here it is, just a short video of doing DTF with Epson Show Color F2130. Until next time.